this because maybe some of you aren't familiar. So I'm in Williams Field right now and I was just taking pictures. For some reason, guys, it's so funny. Today's a holiday and the world is like busy somewhere. Anyway, so I'm in Williams Field and I want to show you guys the old train station or train track that runs like from Porus. I think it's Old Harbor. Like, yeah, so it runs through Williams Field in Manchester. It's so cute. It's obviously abandoned and as you guys can tell, there's bare goats behind me and stuff. But I wanted to walk around and I wish they still use trains as a method of like public transport because that's so cute and cool. I don't think any island on, in the Caribbean has a train. Hi. I don't think any other train station. Anyways, let me show you guys. We're going to go on a walk. Okay, so we're here. I think this used to be like an old like post or something. I don't know. I don't know what they use this for. But maybe this is like to like close the track. Like when the tracks are coming like to switch it because there's two like lanes. So you can go like straight up that way and then straight that way. And then there's that place over here. As you guys can see, this one needs work. So I'm just gonna walk a little bit and show you guys because I'm curious myself. So why not show you? God, so pretty here. These small little cute things. Okay, so this is Williams Field. Railway crossing. Okay, let me show you guys the pond actually, but this is the pond. The goat got loose. I mean, not the goat. I'm so used to goats. The pig got loose, so he had to come back for his pig. So cute. Uh, I was too late at recording to show you guys. Oh, and down there is the pond. It's really nice. They maintain it, but I guess they haven't lately because it's been raining a lot. But it's really nice. It usually has like lily pads and everything. Okay, let's walk down this way. Oh, there's more. Okay, yeah. So over there, that's the other set of train track. This is cool. Guys, I do this stuff because I'm interested and then it's always potential places I can take pictures for Instagram. So pretty. I could have took pictures over here too. Okay, we're gonna stop at that house there or that train place. So here's the same thing again. This is so cool. You guys let me know down below what you think. I wish they still did this because this is a, so, such an old school house. Wow, I love them. Um, let me know what you guys think. I'll oh, be careful. Yeah, I tried walking on these. Walk, walk. I was trying to balance. Let me try. You guys don't mind these slippers. It's because I was going in the lily pad place to take pictures, so. Oh, I bought this in Swallings. The anklet for like $200, I think. Okay, anyways. Okay, yes! Wow, I love this. This is so cool. They should do like tours and stuff. Okay, so we have oh my gosh, they should do, do these for tours. Like there's so much history. Okay, I love this. I don't know what the MPs for these areas are doing because you can totally make these into tourist attractions since they may not be opening it back up that's so cool so just imagine people used to come buy their tickets right here that is so cool and i guess this is like a waiting room area okay, so we're under here okay so this is the office part i wouldn't be surprised if someone lives here so i'm not even gonna touch the door or anything This is so cute. Okay, this is it. I think there's a community down there or something, but this is so cool. Okay, so. Okay, so you guys have to let me know what you think down below in the comment sections. I feel like this is so cool. I wish there was like videos and stuff that I could find just to watch how like time was during when the railway was like so active and rampant and stuff, but it's nice. 
You guys have to let me know what you guys think down below in the comment section. But that's all for this clip. Um, we're going to a party in Spallings. I feel like I always show you guys parties in Spallings. So tonight I'll bring you guys along. People are telling me to like bring my video light and stuff. But I don't know if I want to be that loud with my camera gear. But yeah. So I'll see you guys in the next clip. <laughs> Okay, I bought this to drink. I need to get my nails done. This is embarrassing. Music! Okay guys, so you guys saw that I got breakfast now. I'm going to go wash my hair because I feel like I want to do a ponytail for the rest of the week. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to wash my hair and straighten it and then try to do a ponytail. Yeah. That's it. Okay, I just wanted to show you guys um, after I put up my hair because I didn't want my hair to like get big from the humidity. But she straightened it so good. That. Basically, this is what I did. I straightened it because I'm going to do a ponytail for like the rest of the week, so I just prepped it here. Yeah. It's recording? It's recording. Okay, I'm just showing off my hair. I got it straightened. <laughs> okay, that's it. It's so funny. It just sucks like the music so there was, and it was so packed the thing was there were so many people there like hundreds so I don't know what happens and like the police came and then everyone had to go home so today I'm in Spallings and today I'm in Spallings and I'm just I did my nails Diggins did my nails so this is how it looks okay this is my nails he wanted to put the gem on it I didn't want to but looks fine to me Look at this big, huge cup of water. That one's pee. I'm just gonna be chilling for the rest of the day. And then, yeah, that's really it. Hey. Look, it's raining. It's a sun shower. Tell the camera what you're doing. We're going to. Yes, we're going shopping. 
But we're not going to do nothing much. We're just going to get water. Yeah, but we yeah, still have to show them. One of the main reasons I used to step out to you, I just show. I want to get a break to you. Know? Yeah, I could tell. <laughs> yeah, but. <laughs> because you have to buy the stuff then. You must say you have to buy the thing then, you know? And me tell us that no, I don't want to buy them. <laughs> <laughs> I already knew when he said that. I was like, "Oh, he wants a break." Yes, man. Okay, we're just gonna go buy a few things. I need some of your water to drink. Oh, wow. Hi. Tell me, I walk with good somebody. Amen. Tell me, I walk with good somebody. I walk with bad somebody. Amen. 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 <laughs> okay, where are we going? Which supermarket? We have a road at the front door. I make the camera get the seat. Make the camera get the seat. The look of place. The digging response. Digging, digging's response to the whole entire Spallings. <laughs> if you come to Spallings, you just ask for diggings and anyone on the town can show you where his shop is on the town, right? <laughs> Hi. Why don't we look at Michelle for the video? She said I'll add, add something them, yeah? yeah she said I'll add, add clothes and find more, yeah? <laughs> this one already. We're we'll, we'll go over by Miss Mo. Oh my god, in this store, some girl touched my hair, so after when I just straightened it, she touched my hair, and I was like, why are you touching my hair for? Can't be touching other people's hair. Who did that? I know, when the girl's in here. 400. 200. Okay, we bought the button buffer. <laughs> Stone up, juggling stone up, new dancer, see him. New dancer. Yeah, man, yeah, man. Yeah. Everybody see him. Chris, 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 And here smells like they're cooking frog. <laughs> a frog. A frog smells well? <laughs> I think so. Mm -hmm. Over here. This is a day with digging. A few hours in the life. He's on his quick break. <laughs> his 15 minute break. Those things will make you hungry. Is it make you hungry? Juice. I'm not hungry, thirsty, dehydrated. I bought the orange juice and I was so dehydrated. That's why I needed water. If you're gonna get one of them, get the sour stuff. Do they have yeah. it? Do you like the sour, sour stuff? stuff? Yeah. Oh, it's only this. It's okay. Get the squaw vampire. Somebody give me a light. Do you guys see me? I didn't know you were so okay. We're back with the tattoo artist. Tattoo artist of the century. Bang. <laughs> so this is where he works all the way at the end. So see you guys when I come back. Huh? Diggings. Diggings is buying juice. He's asking if I want one. He's asking if I want one, but I'm okay. Actually, I should have got one. I'm in Christiana. The wind's blowing. So, so make him put in the bulb in there. The, the socket them in there and everything. Because while in there, fix it. In the, some of them they get misplaced and so. See, I'm um, headlight them and put back in my car there. Them headlight they over, over so. So, I'm not really worried about headlight. You understand? Mm. So, tell him something to do the necessary work them and then. Oh, I'm gonna tell you, see, they, they, they fixing some things in his car. Yeah, I'm not
Last night we were just like out, up at diggings like where I do my nails and we we're just there hanging out and then Cruncher Hype and his friends were just like having a listening party because he came, he came out with another new rhythm so you guys can follow him like I always tell you guys to go follow him and stuff he's really nice also i didn't tell you guys the whole like tea on these nails so i would say like two days ago i wanted to get my nails done but diggins was like so packed i didn't book an appointment i was like okay let me see if i can go and get my nails done which i know i couldn't have because like he's always busy like he's like the best in the town so he's like he's the best around in the area so he's always busy anyway so i went to some other lady and this lady was so weird she was taking off my nails because i had like you guys saw my broke up nails in my other vlogs how broke up they were so she had to take them off and she was like, you know, say I don't do um, damaged nails. And I was like, okay, I'll just go back to digging then, right? And then she's like, yeah, your nails are damaged. Your nails are damaged. They're so thin. I'm like, yeah, of course they're thin. Any acrylic that you put on your nails, it automatically thins out your nails. So like, what's new? And then she's like, oh, and you have fungus on your nails. I was like, where, is, where has fungus on my nails, right? Oh, they're so cute. There's some children. I'm um, riding in the back of a pickup truck with like beer. Um, what kind of was that? Fever grass? Mm -hmm. Yeah, fever grass. Anyways, yeah. And I was like, which part has fungus? And she's like, oh, this na na these nails have fungus. I was like, no, my nails are just discolored at the moment. It's not fungus. She's like, yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. I'm like, girl, I know it's not fungus, right? And she's like, oh, this one has fungus too. And it was a nail that I hit. So like, it has like a bruise on the nail. She's like, that's fungus. I can't be doing your nails. It's fungus. But the girl didn't want to do her nails. So Annie started cussing her because we were waiting for so long and she put someone ahead of us. So Annie was just like, you can't do that. That's so unprofessional. We were here. Why would you take someone ahead of us? Whatever. So we left. Anyways, I went to Diggings and I was asking Diggings. I'm like, I didn't even say nothing to Diggings. I'm like, Diggings, just look at my nails and tell me like what you think about my nails. He was like, nothing's wrong with your nails. They're just a little bit thin, but there's nothing wrong with them. And I was like, okay. So, and then I explained to him what happened. He was like, so confused. He's like, you literally don't have fungus. I know. I've been doing my nails since I was 13, probably 12. I, for all those years, I haven't had fungus. So I don't know what she's talking about. And I only go to clean people to do my nails. But yeah, anyways, I'm rambling way too much. Oh, I decided that I'm going to bring like my camera and my lights to karaoke because the last time I recorded karaoke, it was so dark and I felt so bad. So I'm gonna record everything, okay? So we're gonna like that. We're gonna do that. And I'm trying to figure out like what else happened. Um, but yeah, that's it. So bye. Who was 17 when me at 18? Me by me first got 19. 
Breakfast at Jackie's or in Spalling's over here. Holes in the bag. Okay, they're eating breakfast. I came here every single morning, but you guys know I like juicy beef. But sometimes it's good to change it up. People are eating their breakfast. Look at all these peppers. A bag full. These are pretty. Let's see the. Yeah, this one's nice. Look at the color. Okay, we're in Bora Bridge. It's right here. It's on the main. Yeah. 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 Ye
New York is all but it ain't mine no more. I am a sad. Don't know one day. Taking pictures with the donkey, so follow me on Instagram. Listen, animals are nice, you know. I think the ticks from the donkey is dropping on me. These animals are nice, even though donkeys love kick people. You just have to pet them nicely and then they like you. Because this donkey was a coming near us and then as soon as I started petting the donkey, the donkey said, alright, I'm gonna come, I'm gonna come. You guys let me know if you can tell the difference between a male donkey and a female donkey. I'm on that. <laughs> <I'm on that. laughs> <laughs> Okay guys, so it's the next day. It's early morning. I'm just taking some pictures right now. So you guys have to follow me on Instagram at Anisha.Adams. Please follow me because I have so many subscribers on here, but on Instagram I have like 200. So you guys have to follow me. Between me posting on YouTube, I post on Instagram so you guys can get like real time videos on my Instagram stories and like the pictures and everything like that. So you guys go and just subscribe. Go and follow me on Instagram at Anisha.Adams. So later on today, I'm going to be showing you guys like the campaigning for a JLP um, election. I just felt like you guys would want to see this. So um, when it comes on to later on tonight, well later on today when like um, everyone's campaigning like PMP, JLP, I'm going to show you guys. I'm going to bring you guys along. Trust me, I've been seeing pe people prepping this morning while I was like on my way here. Oh, I'm in Anyan Town right now. Anyan Town, whatever you guys want to pronounce it, Anyan Town in St. Anne's. Um, when we get back around the Smellings area, we are serious when it comes to politics down here. So let's go. I just want to show you guys my outfit. I just came back into my van. I want to show you guys. So I got this for $500 and this for $500. Okay. Look how nice it looks. I feel like it looks decent. I, with me, I don't care about price range as long as the thing looks good and I like it. Like the item, the clothing item, I'll buy it. So this was $500 and this was $500. I just put it together. No, no, no. Turn it on. Look here, put you with two guns. I'm not stopping your sauce. Get out. That's open to be careful. No, no, no. This is the one who made the video. Yo, Marvin. You're already in my video. He's already already been in my video before. Lex, he's famous. <laughs> Coverage? No, no. Everyone already knows about Junior. <laughs> Say hi for me. Big X! He's far all the way over there. What's the style? Most went chopstick. She's the only person with her mask on. I stay by myself. Well, because she's doing the right thing. 